Well, we are waiting for the first results, uh, and uh, I know that Facebook uh, announced this uh, within the, the 72 uh, hours deadline, uh, which is uh, uh, prescribed by the GDPR, and uh, now we are waiting for more information from Facebook security uh, managers, because uh, according to my uh, intelligence now, there the should have been 5 million uh, Europeans affected, or better to say their accounts and th themselves, and uh, we need to know more. Uh, for, for these cases, I think Europe is, is good equipped with, with uh, GDPR because uh, we, we have uh, uh, very strict rules and uh, we have a very strong uh, uh, instrument to discipline the, the companies which deal and which handle the private data of people, which is uh, obviously the case of Facebook. And uh, we uh, are awaiting for, for further information over the next hour or so. Days. And essentially, this is one of the first high-profile breaches uh, that would fall under G GDPR. So uh, is there an incentive for you to uh, uh, escalate this case beyond what, what the, initial was, uh, the initial announcement that came out last week and uh, start looking a little bit deeper at other companies, social media companies that also fall under that umbrella as well for other potential GDPR breaches, given that you know, this legislation hasn't been around for that long? On this concrete case, uh, this is now the task for the Irish Data Protection Authority to act, and they are very intensively working on this case. Uh, I am in a close contact with the uh, enforcers. Uh, but you speak about the, the wider concept, uh, con uh, context. Yes, of course, uh, uh, our uh, data protection authorities in all the member states have uh, uh, hard work now uh, in uh, applying the GDPR in full. They are uh, doing the risk assessments regarding uh, different companies and of course uh, the highest risk is uh, in case of the company which is processing the private data in, in a vast or uh, big amount so uh, this is uh, this is now the task uh, for, for all the member states and they take it very seriously I met all the data protection authorities last week uh, they had a plenary meeting and uh, they, they are ready to act in case of need Hey everybody, it's Hadley Gamble from our new CNBC Middle East Bureau in Abu Dhabi. Thanks for stopping by. Now to watch more, you can try one of the videos that just popped up on your screen. And don't forget to subscribe.